What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Cups and Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. Thanks for all the new subscribers. Thanks for all the donations. If you'd like to book a personal reading, links in the description box below. Have a new service I'm offering called Life Coaching. The links in the description box below as well. Um, love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. All right. So I was working on something else, and then I get this channeling. So I'm going to offload it. I hope everybody's doing well. I do. Uh, okay. So it's at least two energies and maybe more in some situations. Um, I heard an air sign and an earth sign. I heard one masculine and one femme that takes on heavy masculine. They're both counselors. I feel for a lot of you guys, you know these people and you're about to see this happen, manifest in your own world. I don't feel it's you. For some, you could be these low vibrational ass counselors, but I feel for a majority of my collective, it's not you. And I'm just being for real. But it's at least two people in the universe. And I heard specifically in the channeling, licensed counselor. So they are a licensed counselor, therapist, what have you, what have you, like an LCSW, like a licensed counselor and therapist, okay? Not just somebody that life coaches or just gives advice for free or what have you, what have you. No, no, no. Nay, nay. Licensed. So they work under their license, meaning they can be reported or they can be or what have you, what have you. They work under a license. Emite works under a license. They can be reported. Or Emite doesn't know that. Man, and they have a responsibility when they work under their license to be a mandatory reporter for any kind of abuse or anything of that nature. Okay? So, like a LCSW type energy is what I'm feeling. It's one femme and one masculine. It takes one heavy femme. They're both counselors, I heard. So, counselor therapy, therapist type energies. One is an earth sign. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, masculine or femme that takes in a heavy masculine. One is an air sign. Um, cancer, uh, not cancer, I'm sorry. Uh, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Masculine or femme that takes on heavy masculine. I heard through many series of chain events, they're about to get into a very serious motor vehicle accident soon. I heard it's going to be um, lots of injuries involved. I heard uh, hospitalization will be involved and probably ICU if they make it, is what I heard. I heard this is very negative, heavy karma because they had been hiding incest in a family. I heard a child has been coming to them for therapy appointments for years, for years. Now, whoever this child is, I don't know. I didn't hear a sign on the child, but a, th a, ch a child has been coming to them for therapy and counseling appointments for years, I heard. They have known about incest within a family for years and abuse of adult family members of this child for years, but they have hit it, meaning they have not mandatory reported it. They have not told a parent that cares or a family member that cares or somebody that cares. They have not mandatory reported it. I heard they've covered it under the rug. So part of their heavy neg negative karma, it sounds like, is these motor vehicle accidents. And I heard they're going to be life-threatening if they survive the motor vehicle accidents. Huge pile of energy here. Huge. Very serious. Very serious. Huge pile of energy here. Huge. Very serious. The jaws of life might have to be used for one of these. And one of these vehicles will end up on fire. Entrapment. Oh, my God, this is terrible. Okay, so the jaws of life will have to um, end up being used on one of these situations. So that's something emergency medical services has to use to open up vehicles when uh, to get people out quickly um, during those kind of situations, from what I understand. Um, and one In one of these situations, there's at least two motor vehicle accidents, but in one of them, there's going to be some kind of fire in a vehicle or on the vehicle or something, and I heard entrapment. Meaning, I think the locks are going to lock or they're going to have to use the jaws of life to get somebody out because they're not going to be able to bust the windows out or 
open the doors or the locks are going to get stuck or something. Some kind of entrapment situation involving a fire. Well, if the, if the smoke starts coming inside the vehicle, that might be what, um, so why somebody passes away. Now, it could be these people. I mean, they might have passengers in the vehicles. For all we know, it might just be them. But it sounds like they are going to definitely be in this vehicle, in these accidents. However, they're connected into the motor vehicle accidents. I don't know. They could have passengers in, in with them or not. I don't know. But this is their, but they're not only, they should have done the right thing years ago, but they're about to bring other people into this shit in the form of pileups, possible suffocation of carbon monoxide from all this smoke inhalation, it sounds like it's about to occur. And one of them, possibly, if somebody don't get the jaws of life out in time. These people are not upright individuals in their community. They're about to experience negative heavy karma. And they, they knew about incest. They knew about child abuse. They knew for years and they covered it up. Someone else is getting a huge wake-up call. Huge. Someone else is getting a huge wake-up call. Huge. Well, that's what happens when you cover up child abuse and incest. If anybody needs to hear that. I mean, I don't wish motor vehicle accidents upon anybody. But I don't also don't wish incest upon anybody and child abuse upon anybody. And these people free willingly covered this shit up. It was for money. But that has backfired upon them too. Oh, that, it's getting better. Okay, so they covered the incest and the child abuse up for money. But that has backfired upon them. Meaning they don't, they made some kind of money from this incest and child abuse. Oh, that's lovely. But now there's about to be some kind of motor vehicle accidents. But it's not just going to involve them. It's going to involve some kind of pileup energy. Other innocent people. Classy so-called counselors. If anybody needs to hear this, this is sick. This is about to create such a huge wake-up call after this occurs. I heard hospitalization in here. I mean, people are going to have to be carted to the hospital if they make it. If there's no asystole, no pulse. Uh, if they have pulse respirations, they're not in asystole. If they're not pronounced, pronounced dead on the scene dead upon impact or what have you what have you this is serious shit out there but you shouldn't be covering up incest and child abuse because you were making money off this shit and i'm not speaking to most of my collective i think most of my collective you're about to see this shit or you're about to see the car accidents or about to hear about this but whoever these people are you're sick in the fucking head i have no respect for you if you, if you watch my channel none and I say that from a single mom standpoint that got my kids taken away and I shouldn't have. It's very nice this year at the collective. After these motor vehicle accidents occur, these people are going to be, it is going to be terrible. It's about to affect many people's lives. At least one of these counselors will reveal very important toxic information on a Libra feminine and a Gemini masculine adults. Pedophiles. They're going to get such a huge wake up call. And in one of these situations, children will be in the car accident and it's not going to go well for the children and the adults involved. Many serious injuries coming. Made the money made money off children's backs in the past. Oh my god, this is so terrible. Mm, okay. So after these motor vehicle accidents occur, it sounds like these people are gonna get a huge wake up call, but it's after they get negative karma, basically. It's after they get negative karma, of course. Of course, they didn't want to do the right thing for years because they were making money off somebody else's kids, of course. And all the while going out in somebody's community pretending to be the best thing since sliced cheese as a licensed counselor, or probably a LCSW or what have you, what have you. But what they didn't want the community and the public to know is they were making money on the back end of children that were being a part of some kind of incest and child abuse and exploitation because they were making money off of them. So some kind of abuse and exploitation situation where they were making money off somebody else's kids. But there's going to be some kind of pileup energy, a fire, a I mean, these are bad accidents. Bad accidents, at least two of them. 
One of them is going to involve kids. It may be their kids. It may be their grandkids. It may be somebody they're connected to's kids. I'm sure it's not the kids they abused and exploited. I'm sure. But it's somebody else's kids that's going to be in, involved in these motor vehicle accidents. But I heard after these motor vehicle accidents occur, um, at least one of these counselors, because there's at least two in the universe, two motor vehicle accidents going to occur. One of them is going to, it sounds like officially report. Officially report, I heard a adult Libra feminine and an adult Gemini masculine pedophiles. So, because I heard they're going to get such a huge wake-up call. Meaning, they know how the laws of karma work. They know how the universe works. And after these motor vehicle accidents occur, these people are smart. But they're they're criminally smart. And they're, I mean, it's just not right. But they know they're going to, they know these motor vehicle accidents are going to be caused because of karma, what they did to these kids in the past. That wasn't their kids, basically. They know what they did in the past. So after these motor vehicle accidents occur, one of them is going to report. The, the pedophiles. And fems can be pedophiles too. And in this case, it sounds like it's a Libra fem pedophile and a Gemini masculine pedophile. And I heard once they report it, um, it's going to make it move fast. So, well, you should have reported it in the, you should have, if these assholes watch, which they probably do, you should have reported it previously. If I was you, I'd report it now. But of course, Everybody has free will, and you've had free will to cover this shit up for years, and that's what you free willingly chose to do. That's it. Of course, you have free will. Bad health. I heard that this is going to cause hospitalizations. It's about to cause children to be injured, adults to be injured, pile up energy, a, a vehicle about to be in flames, possible carbon monoxide suffocation or poisoning. I mean, severe bad health. But you didn't think about these kids that were sexually molested or exploited or abused or sexually assaulted or what have you, what have you. Did you? Nope, sure you didn't. Because you made a lot of money off of them. These injuries are about to be so severe, so severe. And a Taurus probably won't make it. And a Libra probably won't make it. Counselors. Okay, I heard these, uh, the injuries are going to be very severe. So bad health. I'm thinking ICU energy, MICU. I mean, critical care in a hospital energy is what I'm feeling. Um. There's at least two counselors that might not make it. There might be more than two getting in these motor vehicle accidents. Only these people know what they participate in the past on anybody else. But I heard a Taurus and a Libra, both counselors, therapists, counselors, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. They probably won't make it. So there's, it sounds like there's at least two motor vehicle accidents about to occur. It could be masculine fem Taurus, masculine fem Libra, but they're both, both licensed counselors. They probably won't make it out of these motor vehicle accidents. I'm feeling ICU energy. Is exactly what I'm feeling. I mean, I wonder if they're going to be on vents. I mean, I'm just being for real. I wonder if they're going to be on vents. Or they dead upon impact or suffocation from carbon monoxide inhalation because they can't get the vehicles open in time with the jaws of life, with the vehicle fire. They made a lot of money off this, but it has backfired. It is going to continue to backfire. Okay, I heard they made a lot of money off this, but it's going to backfire. And it's going to continue to backfire. So, the laws of karma here. Kids are about to be hurt in this, unfortunately. But that's their the negative karma backfiring. All this black magic shit, all the cover-up shit, all the negative shit they did is about to boomerang back upon probably people they love, people they care about, all because they chose to free willingly abuse and exploit other people's kids. Because of in, in, covering up some kind of incest and child abuse. You shouldn't do that shit, mandatory reporters. Do your damn job if anybody needs to hear it. I do my job when I'm out in the 3D. You, I expect you to do the same.
One of these motor vehicle accidents will probably be on the news. It's going to be terrible. All of these accidents are going to be terrible. But one will probably be on the news. Okay, I heard all these motor vehicle accidents can be terrible. There's at least two. There's at least two people that might pass away. At both adult energies. Uh, Libra and Taurus counselors. So, I mean, they might be in the same vehicle. They might be in uh, one motor vehicle accident. I don't know. But there's at least two motor vehicle accidents, at least two counselors, two separate situations. But bad situations. One of them will probably be on the news. If I heard one will um, most likely be on the news. Um, and, um, so it's, it's going to be bad. It's going to be bad. Well, they should have put, um, when a poor family had a hidden camera in their house for years, they should have put that on the news, but they chose not to do that in communities. If anybody needs to hear that. Now we're getting all this negative karma out in the universe. If anybody needs to hear that. So message. Um, this is news energy, I'm feeling. News energy for one of them. It's going to be bad. And the earth sign masculine, he has dreads. He's 35 and below. He's about to start losing his hair. He has really beautiful hair. He's about to start losing his hair. Through many series of shame events, it's about to scare the hell out of him. But it's about to start happening. It's about to start happening quickly. And he's about to go to the doctor. To try to figure out what's going on. And he's about to get shocking negative lab results. Cancer. Oh my God. What the hell is going on in here? So we have. Okay. So this is negative karma basically. What this is. is negative karma from somebody intentionally covering up child abuse and incest in a family in the past. They could have done something about this in the past and they chose not to. It's at least an air sign and earth sign, two counselors. They could have other placements. They could have fire placements. They could have water placements, but they definitely have air sign, earth sign placements. I'll tell you that. But I'm pulling in an earth sign, masculine, younger. Oh, so we've got at least two more vehicle accidents, bad karma coming. Um, and then we have an earth sign, masculine, younger. I heard he's 35 or below and he has beautiful hair apparently. Whoever this I mean it was very specific. He has beautiful hair. I heard dreads. Um and um uh, so apparently I think people complimented him for his beautiful hair and he's got and apparently it's in dreads. And I'm sure people know y'all know what dreads are. So he has dreads but they're beautiful. So I think people compliment on him and on his um, his dreads is what I'm presuming that they look so good. There's a reason I heard beautiful hair, dreads. But I heard he's about to go to the, uh, he is about to start losing his hair. He's about to start losing his hair. So his beautiful hair, I think people compliment him on so much. I think he was involved in this shit. I think that's why I'm pulling him in. I think he's one of these counselors. Um, people compliment him on his hair, his beautiful hair, and blah, 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 blah is what I feel. But he's about to start losing his hair. And I heard quickly. So, I mean, the hair is about to start falling out. but. He's not, it's not like he's shaving it. It's not like he's doing anything to make it fall out. So hair that once was so beautiful that people complimented him on so much, um, I feel, is about to start falling out. I feel he takes pride in his hair. There's a reason his hair is coming in so strong. I think he's probably African American or some other kind of melanated descent or ethnicity. Um, white people can have dreads too, but, um, uh, but I'm feeling he might be African American or other some other kind of ethnicity or melanated type skin tone, possibly. Uh, but he definitely has dreads and it's beautiful. But it's about to start falling out. I heard he's about to go to the doctor. Get um, and apparently he's going to get lab um, lab tests done. 
Our, once he goes to the doctor and gets lab tests done, he's going to find out he has cancer. So message in this aspect is the lab results from the doctor, doctor's office. Um, I'm feeling his primary care physician or his, um, either his primary care physician or urgent care or something. It might be ER, but the message in this aspect is lab results, um, negative lab results. He's about to find out he has cancer. That's what you get for covering up incest and child abuse. There's a reason he's losing his hair, his beautiful hair, that I think so many people complimented him on in the past. If you need to hear this, image, and you're obviously immature, younger, 35, 34, below, earth sign masculine. I'm thinking you're melanated. I'm serious. But whether you are or you aren't, you have dreads. And that's just the truth. You're about to find out you have cancer. I think you're one of these people. And there's at least about to be two horrible motor vehicle accidents. And one of them I heard is probably going to be on the news. Maybe both, but I heard one definitely will. All right, I didn't hear anything else. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody have a good day and namaste.